Where is the delete button on Gmail? If you're wondering where the delete button has gone in your Gmail, you're not alone. Let's figure this out together. First, let's talk about the Gmail app on Android. In the newer versions, the delete button might not be immediately visible on the toolbar. Instead, you have to press the menu button on your phone to bring up additional options. And there you'll find the delete option at the top of the menu. To get the delete button back on the toolbar, you need to go into the settings. Press the menu button, select settings, then tap general settings. From there, go to archive and delete actions and choose how you want to handle deletion. You can select show delete only, show archive only, or show archive and delete. This will customize your toolbar to include the delete button as you prefer. On the desktop or web version of Gmail, the delete button is usually visible, but there are some nuances. If you're using keyboard shortcuts, you might be disappointed to find that the delete key on your keyboard doesn't work for deleting emails. Instead, you have to use the Shift 3 or hash shortcut or click the trash can icon. However, there's a Chrome extension called Delete Key for Gmail that allows you to use the delete key to delete emails, but only when you're inside an email or email thread, not from the main email list. When it comes to drafts, be careful where you click the delete button. If you're in the draft itself, using the discard draft button, usually a bin icon on the right side, will only delete the draft and not the entire conversation. However, if you use the delete button outside the draft, it might delete the entire conversation, which is likely not what you want. So to sum it up, the delete button in Gmail can be in different places depending on whether you're using the Android app, desktop, or web version. Make sure to check your settings and use the right buttons to avoid any confusion or unintended deletions.